Mary is a community-based health worker. She checks on many people in her community with COVID-19. People with mild symptoms of COVID-19 can safely isolate at home while they are ill. This helps Mary provide care for everyone. Not everyone with COVID-19 can receive care at home. Karim has COVID-19. Mary first needs to check that Karim is stable and is not showing any warning signs. If he is, Mary should arrange for him to be cared for in a health facility immediately. Common warning signs include difficulty breathing, chest pain, feeling confused, and other severe symptoms. Karim would also be better off in a health facility if he is over 60 years old. If he already has existing health conditions which may make COVID-19 worse. Or if he lives in a place where it is difficult for him to isolate himself. None of these apply to Karim. He has only mild symptoms and his wife is able to care for him while he gets well. This means he is suitable to isolate at home. Mary explains that he should record his symptoms and temperature twice a day, in the morning and at night. Karim keeps a written record for 14 days from the day he first became ill. Mary checks that Karim knows what symptoms to look out for. This will help Karim monitor the illness and see if his symptoms are improving or getting worse. The most common symptoms of COVID-19 are a fever, chills, a dry cough, and feeling very tired. Most symptoms usually disappear after about a week. However, if any of his symptoms continue to get worse and he begins to show any of the warning signs, Karim should seek medical care immediately. Mary checks that Karim understands and that he knows who to contact if his symptoms get worse. Karim needs to isolate for at least 14 days after his symptoms first appear. Then if he has been off medication and without symptoms for at least 3 days, he is fully recovered. He can return to his normal life. However, it is important that he continues to protect himself and his community by washing his hands with soap and water for at least 20 seconds, maintaining physical distancing of at least 2 meters, and wearing a face mask in public if required. Stay safe, protect your community, make a difference.